Hello there. I just wanted to go and show you how I use QTX Ulano on my screens and how I get perfect results every single time for uh, super contrast stuff. I haven't tried it with a halftone thing yet, but I will in the future. But for right now, I just want to show you how I get this uh, this level of detail uh, using the setup that I have. So usually what I'll do is I'll obviously have a fresh screen, put down the thinnest possible coat on each side using uh, one of these guys right here by Speedball. And uh, after it's dried up and I put the, and I place the uh, negative on there, I'll set it up under these 121, 120 watt lamps uh, that I bought at Home Depot. And then I'll set it up uh, about two feet away for 10 minutes you don't like just 10 minutes straight and then after that uh take it to the shower wash it off and then just let it dry again and right now i'm like kind of like uh post curing it you don't i don't think you need to do that but i like doing it anyway because i like to make sure like anything that was wet is now dry and uh yeah that's basically it i do suggest using a uh what was it a uh spray bottle to get these really fine detail areas like right there, because uh, 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 a shower head hose is, uh, is not that uh, accurate, I would say. And it uh, helps with a lot of the fine details and stuff like that. So uh, stand by for the future when I try halftone stuff. And I'll see you later.